Hello, hello, hello. Welcome back to my channel. This is Rosie. Who is this? Who am I? Oh, I'm sorry. This is Rosie Rosette 2020. How are you guys doing? How are you guys doing today? Okay, I'm doing fine. Honestly, this is not one of my better days. I've had a couple of setbacks, but you know what? Life will go on. Anyway, honey, I need to talk about Cardi B and Meg the Stallion. And I was like, oh my God, I'm just so naive. Because I kept seeing that, you know, them back to back. And I was like, I, you know, I just wasn't paying attention to it. I was like, yeah, whatever. But then, oh my goodness. I was like, oh, oh, oh my. Oh my. You know, like, oh, really? Um, and then I saw Cardi B. Cardi B. Um, I saw her in an interview on The Breakfast Club. Lord, child, that... <sighs> okay, I just have a question because obviously she's extremely popular and, you know, successful. So I'm not, I'm not being a hater. I'm really not. I just don't understand how her verb, noun agreement, or pronoun, I just don't... I'm not saying she can't talk. She definitely can rap. I and believe me, I love Cardi, but I talk about my own son. She's she's my son's age. Or actually, she's younger than my son. Why can't she speak English? Like, is wasn't English her first language or her second language? Because she speaks it as if it's her third language. You know what I'm saying? I don't get it. I, I, I don't get it. But you know what? I hate to say you guys. I know you guys are going to kick my butt for this. But people down south, they don't they don't speak. I don't know what the heck, what language they speak. I, I don't know. I don't know if I'm being a, 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 a snob. Because, you know, I can barely speak English myself. But at, maybe it's a dialect that I don't. Their vernacular is just, ooh, ooh. So whatever, I guess that's how they get down in New York. I don't know, I don't know, I don't know. But let me tell you, baby. <laughs> Ooh, honey. See, I thought, let me see if I can. I thought, okay, when I saw this, I honestly thought that it was, let me get something to cover this. I thought it was Sweetie and Meg. I didn't know that it was Cardi B and Meg the style. Let me get this. Okay, here we go. Here we go, yo. I don't know what's going to change. But see this right here? I thought that I thought that this was Sweetie Pie. Sweetie. I don't know if her name is Sweetie Pie. Uh, Quavo's girlfriend. I didn't know that that was Cardi B. And these hairstyles. I used to wear this back, what, 20 years ago? Um. Yeah. But that video, baby. So I was like, well, what does WAP stand for? You know, WAP. And I was like, oh, okay, WAP. Is that the, you know, one of the new words or phrases or slang, you know, that the young kids have? And I was just like, oh. And then I was listening to it and I was like, okay. And then Amon Wiggins, so he, oh, he is so funny. I love when he critiques or when he reviews something it is just hilarious he's so animated and everything but i was like what what is that wet anus punane i'll just say that okay i was like oh ooh. but uh they look good they look good one thing i like about cardi b is whoever her stylist is and I don't know if she got this style from being in the strip club and, you know, having that, that swagger, you know, slain or whatever, but Cardi always looks good. I mean, you know, we saw her in Target, you know, with no makeup, no hair, just, you know, plain or whatever, or when she was buying something for somebody in, in another country or whatever, okay, you know, without this wig and this makeup, honey, please monster all right but anyway okay but you know when she does it like when she went to court oh she was so fabulous all of her videos hair makeup the scenery 
she really pays attention to that detail. I, the only other person I think person, well, there's two people, Chris Brown. <coughs> I like, I like his, well, you know, I love Chris Brown. Um, Chris Brown and Missy Elliott. Oh my goodness. No one could ever, I'll do Missy Elliott as far as videos. Um, maybe Michael Jackson. Okay. Yeah. Maybe Michael Jackson, but Missy Elliott. Now everyone is talking about, um, Beyonce and this King is I, or I am King or something King, black is King or something like that. Um, It takes a minute for me to really soak in and appreciate Beyonce's video. I did love that um, woman, the one in Africa, or whatever, or, you know, one. Oh, I, don't, I can't believe I can't believe that. You know, when it was like a billion women and she was dancing like, you know, uh, competing with that guy when they were doing this stuff in the sand, or whatever. <sighs> but Cardi. You know the color, the, the 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 makeup, the costumes. You know the people, the music, the beat, um, uh, the dancing. I don't think Cardi B is a dancer. I, I don't think. I think she can twerk, but I don't think that she can dance. I don't know if Megan can dance. They can twerk, but I don't really know if they can dance. I I, I no. Now Beyonce can dance. Let's not get it. Let's not get that confused. Beyonce can definitely dance, but I like I like the visual. The you know I, I'm a colors person, so you know Cardi B always has color. You know her wigs are on point. The makeup. Oh, I don't know who her makeup artist is. Her clothes, the scenery. You know the matches. It matches the clothes and everything. <laughs> I really, I really like Cardi B's. I love her, um, her videos. I do, I do. And she's so sexual. And I love the way, <clears throat> oh, excuse me. She's so free with her body. And that's a beautiful thing. I mean, she was out doing Meg. And I think, no, I'm, it's not a thought. Meg does definitely have a better body than Cardi. But, you know, she's so free. And I love that. Um. Is she exploiting women? I don't think so. Because beauty is, is beauty, I'm sorry, our body is a work of art. Especially a woman's body. Especially when you add and subtract. Hmm, you see what I'm saying? Mm -hmm, you see what I'm saying? Anyway, um, no, I think her and Megan, they did an amazing job. Um, the song is like, ooh, <laughs> Oh, you don't want to play that at church, okay? You definitely want. It's definitely a stripper's beat. Now, I was talking about P, P Valley the other night. Um, yeah, this is going to be a banger. This is definitely going to be a banger. You know, that Cardi B is something else. And Meg the Stallion. I like how Meg is, you know, attaching herself to this person and that person, that person. I don't like the fact that she attached herself to Tory Lane, but that's not my business. That's not my business, even though, you know, Donna wants to do her thing. Okay, let Donna do her thing. But, you know, I made it. I made it. I'm not talking behind her back because I made a video regarding that. Listen, I've never had a daughter, Megan. You ever want to be my daughter? I have no problems adopting you, okay? But, um, yeah, I just, um, I don't, I, I don't want her with. Tori, I don't care if, however the shooting happened, I don't care if she shot him. I don't care, allegedly. I don't want, she can do so much better. But see, that's what I don't understand because what she sings and how she lives, it doesn't, it's not comparable. But I don't know. I don't, I don't know what Megan got, you know, talking about paying her, you know, tuition to see her or touch her or whatever. And, you know, Cardi B talking about, oh goodness, talking about, um, I don't cook, I don't clean, but I got the ring. Oh, you know, they gonna wear that out. I don't cook, I don't clean, but I got the ring. All right, here we go. Here we go. Here we go. Well, listen, this is about to black out. You've seen in this whole video thing that the whole sun went down. Like, you can only see half my face. I'm still here, 
but you can only see half my face. This is fun. This is fun. Okay. Well, I think I've talked enough. I think my storage is about to be depleted. All right. I will talk to you guys later. Congrat con con congratulations, Cardi B and Meg Thee Stallion. You guys are beautiful. Oh, let's not talk about... Um, no, no. Let's talk about... What's her name? <clears throat> Kylie. She did a nice cameo. You know, people... <laughs> Woo, the internet is just a mess, but they, they have a petition. I think 30,000 people signed because they want her out of the video. Lord help me. Woo, these people are so messy, so messy, so messy. But Kylie Jenner, her body was banging. She looked beautiful. Ooh, I wish I could uh, afford her plastic surgeon because that booty was just banging. Was that a booty video? I, You know what I didn't like? I didn't like the white girl at the end. I'm just, I'm just going to say it. I didn't understand. I didn't understand. That's the only thing I did not like about the video was the white girl in the orange at the end. I didn't understand that. It didn't seem like she fit in. Not because she was just white. She was white. It just, she, they could, now that they could cut out. I, she just didn't go. She just didn't go. Okay, you guys, um, it's dark now, so let me go. Talk to you guys later. Bye.